I'm Dr. Haraya from University Georgia. Um, and represent the Tbilisi State University. Thanks all for you to stay preparing to me. I think my decisions about the blood flow will be interesting for you because I have some new approaches to take on that. Yeah. Not the heart is the only tool to uh, flowing but inside the human body, length of the vessels is about 100,000 kilometers, while the power of the heart left ventricle is only one watt, and it's absolutely not enough to display the so mass during such short time. On the other hand, ECG can be represented in other tools, uh, and what it happens, uh, I will try to tell you time by time. You can see heterocyte unit uh, zero six seconds can be displaced oxygen. And if you take into account the distance between the venous and arterial end is too short, it's too interesting and how the pressure is displaced and how separated these processes. To understand this, you must see to the blood flow from the another uh, way. You know that when the electric signal is transferring uh, through the ventricles, there is some time due to the flow delay between the uh, septal and the free walls, uh, that is difference of the potentials. It looks that uh, the Ventricles represents capacitor with the opposite uh, positions of the charges. That is why a matter inside the capacitor undergo to the oscillated electric field, and the here must be evaluated dipole polarization. That is why electrocytes inside the ventricles begin to oscillate, and how it oscillates, why it oscillates, I tell later. This process is displaced distally due to the negative oxygen inside the all cells mitochondria. It means deeply. So the displacement in displacement of this process takes not only the heart, but all the human body's charged particles. But uh, to do this displacement, uh, erythrocytes have special form. They have become kind of uh, disc, that is why they look like of toroid magnets. Why the magnets? Because the, when the charge uh, transmits here, it's for current, and current is uh, have magnetic field in uh, ring form. But in this ring form is located mostly hemoglobin, which can be changed shape during this process. And oxygen, one of the most electronegative uh, substance in the universe. That is why charge displays and oxygen is specially made for this. In the mitochondria, main function of the oxygen is displacement of these charges. And at the end, I said that it displays also, also the information about the chemical bonding. But besides the low frequency, which evaluates at the electroacoustic wave, which I showed you already, um, that can be displaced also high frequencies, like on the, um, you can see here is showing the um, laser uh, energy absorption by the erythrocytes. It means by the position of the erythrocytes. Uh, Ref reflected energy is absolutely different. It means they both have the um, so it can um, display directly uh, directed uh, waves. But the frequency of the laser wave is much higher than the acoustic wave. It means uh, 
different frequencies can be displaced in the human body and it can be done by the electrocytes. So to understand how it can be done, I tried to show you it's my experiments. I constructed the toroid magnets and rotate around the magnet. Oh, it's difficult, I see. Here is magnet. It's, there is switched on to uh, generate. This is a magnet. Now it's filled by the uh, uh, sodium chloride. It's oscilloscope. You can see this and how it looks. You see here. It's oscillate. It's copper wire and this is uh, current flow. And when I switch on the in other frequencies, more higher frequencies, 10 times higher, you see that all frequencies, it's with the 5,000 and it's 50,000. All the frequencies are dislocated to distant. But this is the same for the blood also. In the red line is black. It's 5,000 and it's switch on. Now it's filled with the blood. It's with the 5,000 steps uh, and I will switch in other frequency. You see, it means by the blood you displace many other frequencies and not the one single frequency. And what it happens in reality, in the Reynolds blood and in the arterial blood, in the capillary uh, current flow is opposite directly. That is why direction of the magnetic field will be different. From the other side, in the hem hemoglobin and arterial electrocytes are oxygenated. That is why they are diamagnetic, or they try to build to the magnetic field. And in opposite to this, in Venol blood, electrostatic must be contracted. That is why direction of the oscillating electroacoustic waves will be absolutely different. From the other side, in this position, oxygen outcomes and incomes in electrocyte. That is why it forms uh, so-called allosteric oscillations. But these oscillations are, have opposite directions. That is why it gives possibility during short time to refract oxygen and uptakes oxygen in the blood in pulmonary circulation and reject oxygen in the uh, arterial systemic circulation. But what we have uh, about the blood flow in capillaries, due to the opposite directed to pressures, initially pressures is uh, electromagnetic pressure which uh, pumps energy to laterally and upcoming uh, pressure from the uh, systolic uh, pulse, it becomes like all the uh, circle uh, rotating pressure formed due to the uh, Lisa juice figures. Here is shown the magnetic field which is, uh, must be flow, uh, forming due to the current flow. And here is the uh, rotating it most li looks like the jellyfish flowing. That is why uh, resistivity of the capillary flow is too low. Reality, really, there is rolling of the uh, plasma between the uh, erythrocytes and endothelial cells, and there must not be shear flow. Such flows is especially to arterial system, but due to the uh, so-called protodiastola, part of the energy comes back. That is why, due to the frequency dispersion of the waves, atherosclerosis plaque is formed from the other ways. Too interesting that shear flow is a main factor for the atherosclerosis, but uh, really uh -huh. there is low shear stress at the areas of the plaque evaluated. Uh, if you understand, the uh, electromagnetic waves can be flow in the blood, mm -hmm. but what is the character of this wave? What is the wavelength of this? 
to understand this uh, crystal, we try to investigate erythrocytes. It's toroidal and uh, not toroidal, but uh, it is antenna, parabolic antenna. And by the optic specifications of the focus, by the geometry of the erythrocyte, you can find that this uh, distance must be about uh, eight microns due to the uh, specifications of erythrocytes. This quantity or the distance, you can also quantify it by the um, stress volume of the heart, uh, diameter of the uh, capillaries, and uh, by the quantity of the erythrocytes inside the blood. This quantity comes closely at the same between the erythrocytes in the capillary system. Must be seven to eight microns. But from the optics, we know that between two nodes can be evaluated half, uh, minimum half waves. It means length of this wave must be two times higher than the distance be between the erythrocytes. And this length is 14 microns. You can see here, 14 microns. And from the uh, distance between the end wavelength, you can quantify the wave number. And wave number is comes close the wave number of the infrared rays, but of this number is specified the uh, vibration molecules inside the body. It means the wave length, uh, wave number uh, is the same as for the electroacoustic wave, but frequency for the oscillations for for the light is many times higher than for the electroacoustic wave. And what it can be missed. Here you can see how the visible uh, light can be absorbed by the erythrocytes. And uh, you can see the formula of the chlorophyll and hemoglobin looks like the same. They are tetrapyrrhal rings around all this. It, it's, the, those are special areas to obtain the. Informa uh, information with energy of the light. And due to the uh, resonance, they can change the chemical connections between the atoms inside the molecules. From the, to the continuum of our decision, you must uh, remember about the information uh, terms about the information code and the algorithms. Information really is the knowledge which we obtain all the uh, study it by the investigation. But this knowledge uh, to us or to others uh, go by the code and by the algorithms. This process can be simplified and can be understood to us. These two lines in parallel systems are the same. One comes from the universe, and the other one comes from the brain, from the investigator. From the other hand, uh, this information can be displaced by the combination of the waves. All of us uh, know so-called FM ra radio. It's no other than the frequency modulation. It means one wave can be modulated by the another. From uh, cases, frequency modulation of other spectroscopy approach the quantum limits detection of the molecular particles. It means the by translation quantum. It means you uh, study molecular uh, substances molecules inside, inside substances. So the, by the light and infrared uh, electroacoustic wave, which are comes closely one to another, forms electroacoustic waves, and it can be displayed the information. Information about the uh, functional activity of the molecules, their structure. For this, in hemoglobin, uh, it's very special molecules because Beside the uh, uptake in oxygen and forming the electro, uh, uh, allosteric conformational changes, 
it also changed the light. These two areas are different uh, areas which can so, sum in uh, different oscillations. It, it means uh, hemoglobin inside the erythrocyte, which is ring uh, form, has special function, function to uptake information and displace it to the cool organ, organs. And how, what it happens? Frequency with higher frequency comes closer to the electroacoustic waves, forms uh, frequency modulated wave, affected its molecules, and due to the resonance, they change their electrons. It means the universe can regulate the molecular uh, intensity and uh, their structure inside the human body in everywhere in, in, at all. Uh, here is not everything right because the rotation of the right uh, wheel must be higher because the oscillation frequency is higher. Wavelength is looks like of this position, but the frequency is higher because um, frequency of the quants is much higher than uh, any other rotation. It means during one side of the green uh, wheel, uh, oscillation of its red line must be many times higher. But these changes must displace at the um, su summit uh, waves forming uh, frequency modulated wave. And what we have, uh, infrared light, which comes not only from the sun, but from the universe at all, penetrate organs much deeply than any other waves. It forming electroacoustic waves and by the uh, signals forming from the sinoatrial nodule, it displays to all the cells and regulated uh, chemicals. It means uh, processes is not absolutely spontaneous and not only the entropy, enthalpy and gives free energy, uh, gives direction to the chemical reaction, but the information from the outside. That is why quantity of the erythrocytes is much higher, about 40% of all the cells in the human body are erythrocytes. From the other hand, area of the capillaries is much higher. From the other hand, also the, the diameter of the capillaries is uh, more uh, small than the diameter of the erythrocyte. That is why they change form like a parachute and give possibility that ultrasound displays uh, to lateral. That is all what I want to see and special information. You can find the articles which was printed already. Thanks for your information. Thank you. Listen, only listen.